Hi guys, welcome back to the Cocktail Vlog. I'm Steve the Bartender and today I'm making the world's best screwball peanut butter whiskey cocktail, apparently. So Leandro from the Educated Barfly held a competition, a cocktail competition utilizing screwball peanut butter whiskey and this was the winner. So therefore it must be the world's best peanut butter whiskey cocktail. I've never tried this cocktail and I've never tried peanut butter whiskey before. Thank you to Peter Patrician who is also the creator of this drink. He, I reached out to him and requested if he could send me a bottle because this is actually not available in Australia. I also reached out to Screwball and they wouldn't send me a bottle. So thank you, Peter Patrician. <laughs> Peter Patrician also makes his own range of bitters. His espresso pecan bitters is beautiful. As I said, I haven't tried this before, so why not? I, what I've heard is it's, it's pretty sweet. Um, I think it's got like 10 to 15 grams of sugar per per ounce, which which is a lot. <laughs> It's it's a it's a liqueur. The peanut butter smell is pretty prominent. It's quite strong. The peanut butter is really strong. Uh, it is really sweet. So this one is labelled as a whiskey or a peanut butter flavoured whiskey. It's only thirty five percent and it does have a lot of sugar. So I class it as a liqueur personally. So it's my first time trying Screwball. First time trying this cocktail. Um, so let's get straight into it. Uh, it is quite sweet, as I said, so therefore, um, and the, the peanut butter flavor is prominent. So Peter uh, only measured one ounce, uh, lowered this instead of going, you know, one and a half ounces. So one ounce, 30 mil, and he's paired it with a dry sherry. So in particular, an Amontillado sherry. 1.5 ounces, 45 mil. Next ingredient is apricot liqueur. I'm using Marionette, which is an Australian brand. I didn't even mention the name of this cocktail. It's the Flor de Peanut Butter Herens. So it's based on another, another cocktail. It's a bit of a, a riff. A 7.5 mil, one quarter ounce apricot liqueur. Three quarter ounce, 22.5 mil. And it's a swizzle, so it's built in the glass and then we serve with crushed or pebble rice and give it a swizzle. 15 mil, half an ounce of simple syrup. And two dashes of Angostura bitters. Unfortunately, I don't have a legitimate swizzle stick, so I'm using just a large spoon and doing this, giving it a swizzle until the glass starts to frost. I've only filled the glass up half away. Once it chills down a little bit, I'll top it up. Garnish with a mince sprig, or in my case, a couple of mince sprigs, and serve with a straw. They have the Flor de Peanut Butter Herets. Cheers. That's an excellent drink. It's really quite bright. The apricot does really well, even though it's only that little little quarter ounce, just that small measurement. It's, it's bright. You get that stone fruit flavor coming through, get a little bit of nussiness from the sherry. Um, and it makes sense using a dry sherry because you've got some other sweet components. And uh, and obviously that peanut butter comes from such a bold flavour in that in that whiskey. Peter, excellent cocktail. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon for another cocktail video. Cheers.